All right, so welcome back. Today in this video, we're gonna be looking at the last section of our surveying review, and that is going to be leveling. Now, leveling is very important. If you're out surveying and you're trying to find the different heights of different things, you're trying to find elevations of your work, or of soils or whatever, um, you need to be able to make sure that things are level, things are at the elevations that they need to be. And so when you're taking these readings, it's gonna be either helpful for uh, the people that are designing that want to know, you know, what's currently out there or for the people in construction that have kind of already set up the foundations, just making sure it is according to plan. So. Um, very important stuff. And so the things that I go over is very basic, but it's something that the NCEES is going to want you to know. So, all right, let's take a look at this. All right, so number one says, given the following leveling observations, uh, BS, it's not what you think it is. <laughs> uh, this stands for back, back sight reading, uh, is 1.2 meters. FS is uh, two meters, and then F FS is 3.5 meters, and then BS is 0.5 meters. Okay, calculate the rise. So uh, the given information is we are given four readings change up the color and we are trying to find the rise All right okay so what formulas do we need well you need some prior knowledge okay and so I want to, I want you to imagine what I'm about to draw. So you are a surveyor, right? And you are out in the field. And you're taking a reading, right? All right. And the first reading that you take, so you have your tripod out, right? And you take a reading. And you're like boop, 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 boop. And that reading scans elevation, right? All right. So this would be considered your foresight. What's in front of you. But you also have, so you've been taking a few readings, right? So you're just on a, elevation, okay, and Take another reading. And this is a bad example. Hold on. All right, so let's say Okay. 
So you, then you take another reading. Say poop, poop, poop. Okay, this will be considered your uh, backside, backside reading. So one is in front of you, looking ahead, and then one is looking behind, which is your backside reading, right? Typically, they are different. Uh, elevations and so you can determine the change in elevation or the rise by um, getting those elevations so you may have a backside reading of 1.2 meters so let's say this one's at one this one's equal to 1.2 meters and this one's equal to two meters so what would be the change in elevation or the rise? Well, you have two. So we'll just say change in elevation point one, because that's essentially what it is. And so it'd be uh, two meters minus 1.2 meters which equals 0 0.8 meters right okay but they give us another point right you can't for different readings you have to have like a um or typically you have a a front side and a back side foresight and a back side reading so um, for our change in elevation for point two, you get, um, we have 3.5. So that's your foresight minus your back sight. 0 0.5, which equals three meters. Okay, so the total rise, change in elevation or rise is equal to 0 0.8 meters plus 3 meters, which is equal to 3.5 meters. All right. So one point two. So we're gonna get C. Hey everybody. I know I didn't take time to formally introduce myself at the beginning, so I did want to let you know who I am and how I can best serve you as you're studying for your civil FE exam. So my name is James Huntley, and I am a civil engineer who has helped hundreds of individuals pass and dominate their civil FE exam. Now, I know this test is tough. And as you're going through material, you may be saying, I don't remember learning this stuff or gosh, these variables are so confusing. Or you just feel like you're really, really busy. And there's so much material that you need to go through that it's a bit overwhelming. So I did want to let you know that I do help and work with individuals one on one to ensure that they pass their civil FE exam. And I've had individuals that have worked with me for 10 weeks. And that's the longest that it has been. And I've had individuals that have worked with me for two weeks. And we went back to back, day after day after day, hours on hours on hours, putting in the work, um, working together to ensure that they went ahead and passed, right? And this exam is so important because I know that you want to make more money. Um, I know that you want to, you know, get some promotions and be able to further your career and have your PE. So definitely want to open and extend a hand out want to be able to save you time right because i know some people that watch my videos you may have been watching my videos for six nine even 12 months 
and you still haven't passed your civil FE exam, and that is the one thing that's keeping you from making more income, more impact, and furthering your career. So it's definitely costing you um, money, resources, everything. So looking to create more success stories, um, I am looking to work with individuals one-on-one. -on -one. I wanna hop on Zoom with you. I want you to share what you're doing as you're solving these problems so I can spot out what you may be struggling with and open your eyes so that you're not going into this test completely blind. Now, for some of you, you may have failed a test once, twice, had some people fail five times, um, or you may be wanting to take this test initially and you just wanna make sure that you pass it up front. So do have one-on-one -on -one services. I also have some uh, do-it-yourself uh, courses that if you're like, no, I got this, I got it all on my own, I know everything, or I, I'm gonna take the time to study everything, I do have some resources and materials to be able to help you in that way. But my biggest fear is that you're investing in something, uh, these programs or these courses, and you know you're not uh, getting back or having proper feedback to help you and to push you forward you're just giving a bunch of information and no one's sharing with you what you may be actually struggling with or what's keeping you from passing your fe exam so looking to create a ton of success stories so feel free um, down in the description box below i have a ton of resources including one-on-one -on -one coaching let's hop on a call uh it's no cost to you as far as you know us talking through your goals and what you're trying to do um and kind of getting a feel for where you're at um so have some programs where i can work with you one-on-one -on -one, and there's also some do-it-yourself courses practice exams study guides resources free material all of that down in the description box below so feel free to check out that stuff. If you like the video, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. This is what I do. Um, we wanna get you to the next phase of your civil engineering career. Um, and leave a comment if you had any questions about um, what I went through, the information that I covered. Um, and feel free to um, definitely schedule a call with me and looking forward to creating more success stories so be sure to check out this next video